Hi there fellow YouTubers, I'm crazy, everyone that saw my video yesterday, that I made yesterday, the solid use packets I got, <laughs> and just some time before that I did a big big haul with like 46 DVDs and yeah I got some more stuff now, so yeah this is another unpackaging video, not as much as before but still. Yeah, uh, I got some stuff here. Let's start with the small one. And D, this is this is something excellent, something great, something that I love. This is one of my favorite movies. I love this movie. And yeah, I bought two editions of it. One DVD. I'm going to show you. Okay, damn it! I think many of you probably can guess what it is. Hell yeah! The one I'm talking about is Hobo with a Shotgun. Kick ass movie, love it. Great. So I got it on Blu ray. Got it on Blu ray. So yeah, I love this movie. Fucking awesome. But I don't like that they went for the yellow color on the sides. I want the white colors. And also, seems like there are no special features on this one. It says nothing about special features. Which sucks big time because this is one movie that I want to have special features on. So I will have to import the Canadian versions as well, but that's a Blu ray. And then I got. Then I got the DVD of it. So the Blu-ray and the DVD. Because I love this movie so much, I got to have it on Blu-ray and DVD. So yeah. It's awesome. Great, awesome, awesome, awesome. Can't wait to check it out again. And as I said, I need to I need to import the Canadian versions of the Blu-ray and DVD. I need to have them. And a poster. So if anyone out there in Canada are willing to help me with that. I want that awesome edition with the fold out and things like that. And that's much stuff that I can get with Hobo with a shotgun. Because I, I'm in love with this movie. The, when those two guys, those two bounty hunters appear, th that, like, oh, that made me so euphoric. So I don't know what, but. I mean, many of you are already seen, so I can do the spoilers. Don't care. I don't care. But those two kick-ass bounty hunters all, all armored up and they are so fucking awesome and cool it's like the best thing from the 80s times 100 it's totally euphoric oh it's so fucking cool the, the guy the guy with the helmet that does the ninja style killings and then the other one that has this <laughs> this harpoon gun <laughs> with a rope tied to it with a, with a little noose you put it around people's head and then shoot that ha uh, harpoon up in the roof so they hang <laughs> so they uh, get the uh, what the hell we call it oh, they get hanged they die but it's so fucking awesome it's cool <laughs> so yeah awesome movie I love it love this uh, the music is cool and the lighting is cool in that movie as well I love this movie I love that movie this is something else not movies and I can't show one because it's a it's a present for, for one. But I bought bought Assassin's Creed. I played it, but and I like it like it. But I don't have it, so I got that one. And this I won't do game updates and such. That's that's just because it yeah it arrived at the same time, so then it gets shown. So but I won't show games otherwise. Yeah. Now we have some more goodies here. Take a look what I got. I got some really cool stuff here that I've been waiting to get. This is a movie that, that I like a lot. I've been waiting to get this one. Sea Pong. Great, awesome movie. Special effects, awesome. It was a long time ago since I saw this one. I think it was in the 90s sometime. But I, I enjoyed it. I thought it was really good. So, Sea Pong. That's a, it's a really good pickup. So some Japanese awesome cool stuff here. Samurai Adventure. <laughs> Bloody yeah, it's great. 
Uh, nothing else equally great, but still a fun watch. Shimmer of the Corn 2. Uh, and I got Children of the Corn 3. So yeah, cheap is good. And that's a present for one friend, so I'll put it aside. And I got another game that was really cheap for PlayStation 2. Talk about Plus. Looked interesting, so I just bought it. And like I said, this I won't do game updates. It's it's, uh, it's about the movies. So there, let's continue here. Scanners 3. Got Scanners 3. Funny thing is that I only got Scanners 1 and <laughs> Part 3. I don't get 2 yet. Well, but I will find Part 2 later on. And this. Oh, well, uh, this movie is great. Finally, I have it. The director's cut of uh, Jack Hill's uh, Spider Baby. Spider Baby is an awesome movie. If you haven't checked this out, check it out. It's crazy. It's fun. Very good. Spider Baby. So awesome. Then I got another Asian one, Asian Vision. I did not know that it came with a slipcase, but that's that's fucking cool. That's cool. Volcano High. Also cheapy, but. I did not know that it came with a slipcase. That, that's a nice surprise. I like slipcases, so I think it's sometimes it adds something special to the editions. It looks a little more. It looks, it looks better. But looking high. Uh, then nothing. Then I don't have much special things left here. But this is a Swedish TV show called High Chaparral. They went to America and they met all of these celebrities, uh, like the singer from Motley Crue and uh, Gary Busey, uh, Fred, uh, Robert Englund. They hanged out with them for several days. They ate food and they drank and you know they they kind of hanged out like friend buddies and did stuff. Some of some of these things are very very cool. You get to see stuff about some of these people that you, you know. You, this is a cool show, but this is the extra material from season two that they didn't use. So I think it's over two hours of material that they didn't use, things that they cut out and such like that. So I'm interested in this. So I think it's cool. And I bought actually a CD with a band called Face Down, and I see them live. And actually, why I bought this is is because there's a DVD in it. Uh, from the show that I went to, and I'm in that DVD, so I just bought it because of that. So yeah, just, just because I was in it. So. And the band is oh, quite good. Yeah, but that's it for me, and uh, today I'm going out for a swim again, so yeah. But take care everybody. See you around. And yeah, maybe I should do, maybe do some shoutouts for some people as well that are, that are allowed in New York. But I have to shake my time. And I got loads of time, uh, but yeah, there's so many cool guys on YouTube. Dyslexic Nick is a cool, awesome friend on YouTube. He's a great guy. I talked to him yesterday, and yeah, it, it, I don't know, yeah, it really, really helped. <laughs> so and he's a great guy. We're we're into some very cool, <laughs> very cool. We're into many of the same things, so it's pretty cool to have a guy that. That almost you do 99% likes the same stuff that you do, so yeah, that, that's not not something common and ordinary that you meet people that that are like that. So yeah, that's cool. Oh, the six six six, you are great. Oh, the six 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 six. I don't know. I, the sixes are too little or too many. I don't know. But oh, the six 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 is a great, 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 great guy. Awesome videos and. Uh, He's, I, I like him a lot. He's a really cool, awesome fellow. I wish it that he would do some more videos, but I guess he, he's got lots of work and stuff to do. So. But I always enjoy his videos. Teddy Doorman is the same. He also does great videos. <laughs> this is his latest review that he did with that uh, B cheesy, bleak, crappy movie. I don't know what it, what it's called, but Bingo. What the hell? Uh, Geek, geek, blood, bingo. No, geek, geek, something like that. But it it was really funny. I didn't know about that movie. I I learned something new there. 
and it looked really funny. So, <laughs> so I, 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 I want to check that one out. But that was good now. I liked it. Thanks for presenting me for something new that I didn't know anything about. Uh, and then, and also, yeah, your stuff hasn't arrived yet. I don't know what they're doing, but I paid for it. So any day now, they can, they will come in my mailbox. Hopefully tomorrow, and I, if they come, I will mail them to you straight away. Uh, yeah, and then yeah, so many other guys. Marco around 30 that I've done loads of shout out for lately. He's a great guy. Adam Spanish Germ 669. Jonathan, Mr. Movie Passion, I think his his name is. But I don't haven't seen much videos from him lately, which is pretty sad because I I like when he did his DVD updates and such. So yeah, but uh, we're looking forward to the time when he returns and makes some more videos. Then another great channel that I did a shout out for for a while ago, Horrors Ball. You really need to check out his channel. He's an awesome guy. He does awesome, great videos. You check him out if you haven't. He needs more subscribers, he needs more support. All of these guys are great, so check them out. There's so many others. There was a Roasted Skulls, he's also fucking awesome and great. Uh, then there was... Oh, I'll get that, I don't remember the name. Visitor Gozo Killer, I think. But he's he's been commenting on my videos and stuff lately. Uh, I mean, uh, yeah. I've been getting some support lately, so that I'm pretty pleased. To, to get so uh, thank you for that everyone uh, there's so many guys out there that are great and I, I, I can't forget it I can't, I can't remember them all Dom last a lot he's a cool guy as well uh, and I, w I won't uh, oh there's so many and this video is turning out to be too long I will do a shout out video sometime later on but now now I need to go to swim it's hot here I can't talk properly my English is <coughs> like it's real crappy today, so yeah. Pronunciations is totally wrong and such, and the grammar and everything. But forget about it. Take care, everybody. I, I, I love you all, and see you later. Bye.